Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Zahira Bam Ismail, and as always, an absolute pleasure to be joining you here. We're all running around. It's crazy busy. There's a million things that need to be done, whether it's from work, school schedules, managing our children. If you've got young toddlers at home, it's hands full. Older children, managing everything, family commitments, uh, community commitments, our charitable commitments, it doesn't end. But our homes need to be our safety space. It needs to be our spaces for peace. It needs to be our sanctuaries. We need to understand, you know, I think as mums, we are so busy trying to get a million things done that when anyone comes in, we're already at our wit's end because we've had such a long day. And all you want is people just to listen to you so that it can get done and you can all just sit down together. But by then, we're so busy shouting and screaming and no one's heard a thing that we're saying. So when anyone walks into the door, understand that no matter how difficult it's been outside, no matter how difficult it's been as a day, just take the time out as a family to calm down to sit quietly and to relax. Iftar gives us such a beautiful time to be able to connect as a family. I hear so often, you know, with families managing different jobs, managing sports events, managing children's schedules, that there isn't even time for a meal together as a family. But the wonderful time about Ramadan is it makes us slow down. It makes us slow down. It makes sure that we get to have that one meal together where every single person in the family is part of it and every single person is at the table and every person gets to be heard and every person gets spoken to. It's so important to validate each person so that they feel a sense of belonging and a part of a home and a part of a family. And I think we need to understand the value of what it means to be a family and how it extends into the community. Make sure your child and make sure every person at your table has a sense of belonging and a sense of this is my safe space. This is, a, uh, this is a space where I'm most at peace. And this is a space that I want to come home to. Nobody wants a home where it's difficult or they're apprehensive about walking through the door because they're not sure what to expect. As family members, as parents, it's not up to the next person to create it. We are all and each individually responsible for creating these spaces. So let's take the time to make sure that we create and provide these spaces to all around us. Again, don't worry about what everyone else is doing. Let's try and do it ourselves and watch the ripple effects from there. Shukran for joining. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.